Welcome back you beautiful people and welcome to a very, very cold Forest of Dean, where I think hardtails are the best bike ever. Sorry, Blake, no. but you're wrong. What? No. Because trail bikes are the best bike ever. I don't think so. Look at all the faff that goes with that. Look, rear suspension, you don't need that. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, keep this laughing. This guy, oh, you're in for a bumpy ride today when I prove to you that this thing is the weapon of choice. Nah, I'm gonna prove that this is the best. Well, there's only one way to find out, versus. Yeah. Mano El Mano. First one to get a puncture, losers. Actually, I have Mano <laughs> myself in the foot. Right, could be we gotta go up. Let's go up. We gotta go up. To come back down. Which is better? I'll tell. No. Ooh. <sighs> Climbing, Richard. Yeah. I think mine is way better for getting the power down. Okay, you haven't got no bounce on the back, I'll give you that. Yeah. However, mine's eating up all these little bumps right now. What bumps? Super comfortable. It's a fire road. <laughs> <laughs> There's still bumps. <sighs> okay, Blake. Granted, that hardtail does look a little bit easier up the hills. Ah, oh, mate, it's so much better climbing. You're shifting a bit less weight, I suppose, aren't you? Yeah. And all the power is not being lost through any bounce. No, it's going straight to my rear wheel. <sighs> I can lock my shock out, obviously. Yeah. So that would make it a bit easier, but I've still got the weight. You still, yeah. Ooh. Telling you, hard tails, mate. Hard tails. Yeah, they may have some advantages. The dream. All right, Blake, we're nearly near the top, and I'll give you it, that climb does have some steep kicks to it, and I could see that less bounce and lighter weight on your hard tail did look a little bit easier. Yeah, getting all my power done to that rear wheel. But technical climbs, which we've got a few little bits to come, I dare say the extra bounce and the traction that I'll get on this mm. could come into its own. Yeah, being a full suspension bike, you can track the ground when it's a bit rougher, mm. getting as much power down, getting a lot more grip when the trail gets a little bit more techy. Whereas for me, I was uh, all over the place. The spin in the rear wheels, I was. All that power. Anyway. Right. To the top and let's get some flow back down. Yeah, I'm ready for flow. I feel like it's gonna be a pump track dream all the way down. Oh, oh, pump track talk life. about pump track, we're gonna hit that up <laughs> later. All right, Blake, we're at the top of a flow trail and I think it's going to be pretty close between these two. I think they're going to, you know, have their own pluses and minuses, but there's only one way to find out in there. Let's do it. It's the final countdown. <laughs> this is the countdown trail and FOD uh, is super chill, mellow, like you said. Mm -hmm. I reckon we should just drop in and have as much fun as possible. But I feel like this, I'm not going now. Let's go. <laughs> That's but flow trails are the flipping best, aren't they? They they are because they're not overly hard, but they're just really fun. Super fun. Yeah. Uh, do you know this? I felt super quick planted. You know those rollers I can pump it. Yeah, definitely. I'm getting all the power I want out of this bike. Yeah. Onto the ground. Agreed. A, a little bit more cumbersome, but once you firm up the shock of it with the old lever, actually, it's really fun to manoeuvre around as well and grip in the turns. Oh, Maybe man. not quite as efficient, but. Definitely plenty of smiles all around on that one, I think. Mm. I think we can call that a draw between the bikes. I think it's a draw. Yeah. Right, now we're, we're at the top, kind of midway. Yeah. I reckon we should hit some two different trails. Okay. This is corkscrew. We're going to go down as mm. it's rough as roots. It's going to test, you know, suspension. Yep. Or the riders are going to ride. <laughs> <Or lack off. laughs> we've got this one, and then we've got one over there, which we can go to in a minute, which is um, ski run. Ooh, turn That's it up a notch. I like it. I reckon I'll follow you down here because I might be a little bit slower than you. Now, now, before we get shredding and into the gnar, let's talk about our rigs first. Now I'm running the Nuke Proof Scout hardtail. I've got 150mm fork up the front. This is an aggressive hardtail, so the geometry is quite slack. It can take on a lot. 
I've got 27.5 wheels on this bike and I've got some super duper gnarly stopping power on this bike. I've got four part brakes, front and rear. I know this bike is super capable because I've done the mega on it. Whoa, I was just checking out the stats actually of my mighty fine Newt Proof Reactor. 290C, full carbon, 130 mil, absolutely stunning trail bike. I'm sure Blake's banged onto you about his being an aggressive hardtail, blah, blah, blah. But this is where it's at. 130 out back, 140 up front, 29ers, big old aggressive tires, four pop brakes as well, because apparently that's a thing for Blake. Woo! And uh, well, one by 12 group set, so I can go anywhere. This is the surely the one to choose. Dropping in. Yes, we are. And what's looked in? That was fun, yeah, bit of roughness. Good. Kind of reminds me of that old race I did. Anyway, I snapped a zip time. I... Yeah. <laughs> Dude, you had a bit of a G out, yeah, but prop. the max is only going to get rougher. Is, and I uh... think we should drop into that roughness. Drop into the ski run. <laughs> Rich, that was that was good fun. That, that was, was good wicked. Fun. But you know what? I can feel that you were leaving me a lot. Yeah, but you're like a gazelle yeah, skipping through it. there. I was skipping. You know, pick my line wisely. Mm. Dance. Whereas you're like a bush pig, you just steam <laughs> through, <laughs> like Timon <laughs> and Pumba. Uh, but, well, thank you for referring to me as a bush pig. But I hate to say it, the trail bike took that one. I, I think. think. One two, more challenge. Two one trail bike. Yeah. One more challenge though. I'm gonna try and find it back. Pump track challenge, timed run, one run. Right here, ready? You better win. Oh, better. <laughs> Don't Let's you go. Lock out your bike. Uh, well, come That's on. That's essentially a hard tail. Three, two, one. Let's go. Oh my, it's so bouncy. That's no. actually, that's quite good. Oh, don't tell me I won. Look at your eyes have got all watery. <laughs> it goes uphill at the end. 24. Oh, okay, two seconds. Not bad, considering. That was good. Nice one. All right, let's go do some jumps. I think we should. Let's go do some jumps. Let's go have some fun. <laughs> I think the hardtail, 100% is the best bike in the whole world and you should, we should all have one. <laughs> Get back because Blake, unfortunately the trail bike is hands down the best bike ever invented, ever. No, I don't think so. Hardtail, built for everything. Well, through, through some thorough si <laughs> through some science today, yeah, yeah. 
It was a draw. Actually, they're both amazing bikes and they both did everything and they both put smiles on our dials. And that's the main thing. Yeah. Just putting smiles on our face and having a great time on bikes. Yeah. <sighs> Which bike do you ride? Let us know in the comments down below. Trail bike, downhill bike, enduro bike, uh, big super enduro, hardtail, BMX, unicycle. Let us know. <laughs> Don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like, and follow us on all our social media platforms. <laughs> and we'll see you next time. Goodbye, everybody. Au French. A Arrivederci. Or goodbye. Auf Wiedersehen, German. There you go. Sayonara, Japanese. Amangwana, Shona for good night. Uh, Toodle pip. For what? British. Okay. <laughs>